Hi, everybody. I am Holly Celliano, and today I have my special guest, Sally Arnold, on again to talk about Life Plus, we, our series on health. So before I begin, I'm going to play my disclaimer. All opinions expressed by the program participants are so current opinions and do not reflect the opinions of the host or their respective affiliate partners with which the program participants are affiliate may have been previously disseminated by them. The program participants opinions are based upon information they deem reliable, but neither the host nor its affiliates warrants its complete accuracy, and it should not be relied upon as such. This is for informational and educational purposes only. Okay, welcome, Sally. Thank you for coming back on on our series of health. Pleasure. Lovely to be here. Yes. So last week we talked about the products on doing a colon cleanse and the the daily bio basics that you take daily that i'm taking daily that have absolutely transformed my life i was saying how um and this is health so i don't mind talking openly about my health and what i experienced but for over 30 years i suffered constipation and being on these products after i would say 6 weeks it's totally corrected my um that issue I've had and suffered my whole life. And I feel like a new person what, you know, everything begins in the colon. So when your colon is functioning properly and eliminating the food that's stuck in there, oh my God, it, it improves your health on levels that, as you know, it, it's, there's no price you could put on having your health. 100% and I think we know that more than ever now with what we've learned in the last four years so if we can find a way to stay healthy and stay away from the doctors and pharmaceutical drugs you know that's what people are looking for now it's so important yes so today we're going to talk about because life plus has a product for weight loss and why don't you go into what that product is it's, I wouldn't say it's a product as such. It's a program that we follow. And while we're following the program, we're taking specific products that help to support the body. But in terms of weight loss, I mean, for me personally, I've been a yo-yo dieter from the age of 16 up until the age of 50, which was when I did the metabolic reset. That was actually how I got introduced to Life Plus. And there isn't a diet that I haven't tried. And I got to the point that I would actually gain and lose three stone every year, not realizing what an effect that was actually having on my health and on my metabolism, actually making it harder to lose weight. So the Metabolic Reset is a phenomenal program that actually resets the metabolism back to its highest point but it also specifically targets visceral fat, which is a really unhealthy fat, which is the main cause of heart disease and type 2 diabetes. Well, I've wanted to try everything that this uh, company offers. So I went on that as well. I have yo-yo dieted my entire life. I think I've tried every single diet. Um, you know, put some weight on, you lose weight, put weight on, lose weight my entire life. And it's exhausting being on that. Uh, every time I put more weight on again in that year, it's like, oh my God, now I've got to go back on a diet and lose it. And it's really exhausting. And I put on from Thanksgiving through New Year's this year, I put on 11 pounds and I'm like, okay, it's time to take it off because if you don't take it off, then you just keep adding to that. And then after another year and another year, you put on way more weight than you wanted. So I'm like, all right, I'm going to go on this program or not even a program. It's, I wouldn't even say it's a diet. It was so easy to do. And I have lost 12 pounds since January. And so I'm Brilliant. at my goal weight where I like to be, and I will maintain that it, the, I mean, I'm just, like you said, that visceral fat goes away and the body just gets slim. Um, 
and you feel healthy, you feel great, you feel so much better about yourself. And um, why don't you go into exactly what that does, what what it is you're taking and doing and how the, uh, um, what you're to eat on that for people that are, are concerned. Okay. When I did the reset, I actually lost 25 pounds in 28 days. And it's the first time in my adult life that I've kept weight off. Because I say, I used to yo-yo and yo-yo. Um, and what I've learned is that we actually, when you're dieting in a traditional way, you're actually burning the wrong fat and you're slowing your metabolism down. So the slower our metabolism, I can't even say it now, metabolism is, um, the harder it is to lose weight and the quicker you will put you will put it on so as we age as well once we reach about 30 35 we start to lose lean muscle tissue every year and the least amount of lean, of lean muscle tissue we've got the slower our metabolism and then every time we're dieting we're actually losing lean muscle tissue because we're losing the wrong fat. So we're slowing our metabolism down even more. So as we age, our metabolism's dip in. As we're doing diet after diet after diet and burning the wrong fat and losing lean muscle tissue, we're slowing it down. So then it becomes that you can virtually look at a slice of bread and you've, you've put on a pound or a, a kilo mm -hmm. and it, it just gets wearing, it gets tiring. And it was just you get stuck in that continual cycle. And I joke and say to people, I think I held the crown for queen of yo-yo dieting. Literally, I'd have a big gold crown on for sure. So this has totally broken that. The other thing that it did for me was that I'd actually been begging for a knee replacement. Anytime a knee was bent, I was in pain. But I was 48 when I went and had the MRI scan and saw the surgeon. And I was laughed out of there because he said I was too young. But within five days of taking the products, my knee pain had gone. So I've gained my health. I've kept the weight off. My knee pain has never come back. And I know that I can stay healthy through the products that I continue to take. I'd never not take them in a million years. Um, so people gain weight for four reasons, really. Lack of nutrition, because when our body's craving uh, sorry, when our body's lacking nutrition, we crave, but sadly, we don't crave spinach and apples. We crave sugar and fat, which is really, really addictive. And when you're eating sugar, your insulin level is shooting up. It's at that point that it converts to body fat, but then it crashes just as quickly, leaving you craving more because you're eating carbs and sugar. And it's that that's collecting around the organs, as in the visceral fat. And visceral fat is an absolute science to lose in itself. Uh, the other problem is acidity in the body. Acidity is the cause of so many problems and inflammation. An acidic body is an inflamed, a sick body, and it's one in which illness thrives. But it's like the body, it can't process properly when we're acidic. Um, third problem is poor gut health. And most of us have got poor gut health because we don't have enough probiotics, prebiotics. We don't have enough fiber. And then the fourth is obviously the, the metabolism. So we need to address all of those. So we have a way of targeting the visceral fat and resetting the metabolism back to its highest point. And because of how the fat cells open, it's actually a, the most phenomenal detox in terms of cleansing the cells. Um, so this was based on some research that was done back in the 70s by Dr. Simeons, ATW Simeons, who was really, he, he became fascinated why overweight people would virtually starve and not lose weight, why skinny people would eat and eat and eat and not put on weight. He then became curious about why women in third world countries gave birth to plump babies. That didn't make sense to him. And he discovered a hormone called HCG, which all of us produce you know on a daily basis but when we're pregnant we produce more of it and the reason for that is that uh, it forces visceral fat and even underweight women in third world countries have a certain amount of visceral fat the role of it is to protect the organs um it forces visceral fat through the umbilical cord into the baby hence they give birth to plump babies now as soon as those babies are born they become malnourished and they lose weight but he, he sort of started to do research on that. And he started back in the 70s doing weight loss trials using pregnant women's urine. We don't use anything like that. We don't use anything with a hormone in. Don't panic. Um, 
but he, he was seeing results. He then realised that there was a way of not just getting rid of this visceral fat around the middle, that middle age spread when men get, or in Britain they do, I don't know if they do in America, but they get beer bellies. Yes. Um, there's a way of not just getting rid of that, but actually resetting the metabolism back to its highest point, which was when we're younger, it's so much easier to keep the weight off. Um, so I'll draw it because I think it's easier to understand. So this is a very, very rough drawing, but I just think it's, it's, oh, it's good to visually see it. So we have three types of fat that the body uses. So this is, this is the head, we have the brain, and we have the hypothalamus gland. It's the hypothalamus that regulates the metabolism. And then if you imagine the body, the three types of fat that our body uses, we have calories in versus calories out. So if you eat too many calories, then your body is burning off. You're going to lay it down around the middle, which is this belly fat, which is visceral fat. It's full of toxins and it's a really hard fat to lose. And then there's a third type of fat, which is the one that you really don't want to lose. But sadly, that is what we lose. And I'll explain why. And that is your lean muscle tissue. Um, and your heart is a lean muscle, so you don't want to lose weight from the heart. So when we do a traditional diet and we cut calories, our body uses up our energy stores. And then when our energy stores are depleted, when they're empty, our body will turn to our lean muscle tissue, which we shouldn't actually be losing. And only when that is completely depleted, if somebody did a really low calorie diet, in England, we have something like called Cambridge diet and lighter life, which is sachets, um, which I know now is something that I did, I did three times, but I know now that the nutrients would have been synthetic, you know, which weren't good at all, because your body actually wasn't getting enough nutrition. But when, if you're doing a very low calorie diet, it's only when this is depleted, will the body turn to lose visceral fat? But what happens traditionally is on the scales, because we all get obsessed with losing weight when we step on the scales, on the scales, when you've done a diet and you've burnt this, you'll think, oh, I've lost half a stone or I've lost 10 pounds. So I'm just going to go back to my normal eating. So you don't even touch this. So you get stuck in this cycle of burning up your energy stores. Then you do a diet. You lose a bit of weight on the scales, but you're losing lean muscle tissue. And every time you're losing lean muscle tissue, your metabolism's dipping, 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 dipping. Very rarely are people touching this. So this is a way of not, as I say, not just targeting this and protecting this, but actually resetting the metabolism. So what we do, we've got a little activator, which I don't, do you want to hold up your little activator? Yeah, you can't really see it. It's just a little bottle. It's actually radionically. That's <laughs> yeah, a hard. It's a little, a little. There jar. we go. Yeah, uh, just about. Almost. It's just a little tiny bottle. It's a little tiny bottle and it's radionically charged Himalayan salt, which works in exactly the same way as the HCG. And what it does when we start to take it, it activates the hypothalamus gland and it actually opens the flat, the um, flood doors of the visceral fat. But when the floodgates open, your body is flooded with toxins. So we need to do a detox. So for a minimum of 21 days, we call it the diet phase, but we're going to do a detox. And we're cutting out what the body isn't actually designed to metabolize. We're going to rest the body. We're going to rest the adrenal glands from fighting what it sees as toxins. So for 21 days, we're going to cut out alcohol. We are going to cut out anything processed. So no E numbers, no artificial colors, no diet coke. I mean, that, that's horrific, that stuff. Nothing with an E number in it at all, not even a chewing gum. Um, we pe People panic because they think, what can I eat? I'll tell you what you can eat. You can eat really beautiful food. We are going to cut out dairy. Now, this isn't forever. 
it, this is just for this period of time. We're going to cut out all fat. Now I know we have healthy fats, but this is just during this 21 days or longer if you decide to do longer. And we are gonna cut out carbs. So carbohydrates. Now, not only does that mean pasta, potatoes, rice, bread, it also includes fruit because fruit is very high in sugar. And it is going to include, it includes carrots, peas, sweet corn, pulses, and any root veg. Um, so we're just going to cut out this. But what you can eat is lean meat, you can have fish, you can have eggs, lots of lovely salad, lots of lovely vegetables. You can make curries, stews. You can eat really, really well. You're just eating really, really cleanly. Now, if we went straight into doing this detox, our body, would straight away use up its energy stores, then it would turn to our lean muscle tissue. Now, we, this is our structural fat, so it's underneath the skin, it's in the joints, it's, it's in the lean muscle. Now, we want to protect this because we don't want turkey necks, we don't want bingo wings, we don't want hanging jowls. We need to protect our skin, especially us ladies as we get older. So we need to protect this, so before we go into the diet phase, and this is really, really important, and if I had a pound for everybody who didn't do it properly, I'd be off in the Bahamas now, laying on a sunbed. Um, for two days, we're going to do what's called loading. Now, this is really hard for people to get their head round because they want to lose weight. They don't want to eat lots of calories. But for two days, we're going to aim to eat 4,000 calories of really high fat food. Now there's for two reasons, it's gonna store up your energy stores, because if we store up the energy stores, it's gonna protect our lean muscle tissue. It's, all going to sh it's also gonna shock your metabolism into waking up. It's gonna give the metabolism a miss massive big kick up the backside. So it's really, really important. Now what I say to people is to do it with healthy fats. Try and avoid sugar and carbs if you can, but do it with smoked mackerel, avocados, macadamia nuts, olive oil. Um, you know, you can have cheese, you can have double green, double cream. You can do it with hagen dazs and in England, fish and chips, but you'll feel you won't have as much energy. So if you can do it with healthy fats, it's a really, really good idea. And the people that load the best, lose the best. I've even had people that have lost weight in the two days because they've shocked their metabolism that much. And people that don't load, they just don't lose the same way at all. So we're gonna do two days loading and we're taking the little activated salt and we use it, we just sprinkle it on the back of the hand and just lick the hand. And we take that four times a day. We take it 15 minutes before breakfast, lunch, dinner, and again at bedtime, especially we, you mustn't forget when you start your loading phase, because that's going to make sure that the energy stores here and not here. Um, and then we're going to go into the diet phase. So our hypothalamus is activated. The floodgates are open. Our body's flooded with toxins. So we're going to drink lots and lots of water to flush those through. And we are going to do the diet phase. Now, what you can do is do longer in the diet phase. I did 28 days. I got to 21 days and thought, I'm actually really enjoying this. I'd like to lose a couple of pounds more. Some people do five weeks, some people do six weeks. Um, it's entirely up to you, but it has to be a minimum of 21 days to, to rest your body. And then what happens, we go into what's called stabilization. That's also 21 days. And this is key as well. And again, if I had a pound for everybody who didn't stabilize properly. So stabilization literally does what it says. We stop taking the little salt activator. And it's at that point that the hypothalamus click, kicks back in and your metabolism resets to its highest point. Now we want to stabilize it there. If we start adding in toxins too soon, it's going to dip and we've got a really good chance of resetting the metabolism. So it is worth doing properly. If somebody just wanted to do this bit, I'd tell them not to bother. You know, if somebody just wanted to mess around and, oh, yeah, they still wanted to have a drink at the weekend and they still wanted to eat bread, I just would say don't bother. Um, so during stabilization, we stop taking the activator, the hypothalamus is kicked back in. So for the first two days, 
we just follow this. We follow the diet phase for the first two days. The only difference is we're not taking the activator. And then over the next 19 days, we gradually, and I mean gradually, add in a little bit of dairy, a little bit of fat, some pulses, a little bit of fruit. You can add in your carrots, peas, sweet corn. Um, you can add in a few nuts, some oily fish, but you're still staying away from the three baddies, which is alcohol, processed and carbs. Now, what a lot of people do is go a little bit mad. They think, oh, I can have yogurt. I can have butter. I can have cheese. I can have fruit. I can have oily fish. I can have sweet corn. I can have peas. And they go a little bit mad and then their body screams at them because it might be something that doesn't agree with them and they don't know what it is that's caused it. So what I would say is literally just add something in each day. And if your body tells you that it's not right, you know not to have it again then. Um, so what some people do is do cycles. I've got some photos that I'll share in a minute where you always do two days loading. You always do minimum 21 days diet phase and you always do 21 days stabilization. And then some people go around and do another cycle if they've got a bit more weight to lose. They'll do the two days loading, 21 days diet phase, 21 days, uh, 21 days stabilization even, put my teeth back in. And then they might go around and do another cycle. It's something that I do every year. In January, I always do the colon cleanse because I think that's a phenomenal thing to do after Christmas. But I also then go into the reset. And it's not about losing weight for me. It's about the cells opening and doing a massive detox because I think it's a phenomenal thing to do. So that's how the reset works. And then while we're doing it, we are supported nutritionally. And this is what alkalizes the body. It addresses the gut health and it gives us all the key vital nutrients that we need. And this was my introduction nearly nine years ago. And I have never missed a day of taking the product since because I want to know my body's alkaline. I want to know I've got good gut health. And for me, it's definitely what has, has kept the weight off. Because if I stop taking the products, I'm going to go back to being unhealthy. I'll go back to craving. I might have reset my metabolism. I'm soon eventually going to put weight on because I'll go back to craving rubbish. I'll go back to being acidic. I'll go back to having poor gut health. So... With the products, because they're medical grade nutrition, uh, all of the ingredients, any plant base that's used is tested for heavy metals and contaminants. All the products are made in accordance with organic regulations. Um, we have a philosophy. So even if you just park the reset for the moment, but we have a lost philosophy of cleanse, nourish, protect. We need to cleanse the colon so that the colon can absorb more nutrients. We don't have enough fiber in a Western diet. And in the small intestine, you've got little villi, little fingers that absorb the nutrients. So we need to keep those cleansed. Um, we also need to nourish the cells with trace vitamins and minerals. Um, we also need good gut health. And sadly, the majority of probiotics and prebiotics that people buy, half of them will be dead in the pot. The other half will be killed on the way down by throat acid and stomach acid. But our probiotics and prebiotics won't activate until they reach the exact enzyme in the gut. So really good gut health. And 85% of the immune comes from the gut and 95% of serotonin production comes from the gut, which is why people start to feel good. They start to feel happy you know, and they, they start to have energy and they start to have a bit of a spark, you know, about them. Um, so we cleanse the colon, we nourish the cells with trace vitamins and minerals, but in the body we have free radicals and that comes from our environment, from chemtrails, cigarette smoke, exhaust fumes, air fresheners, deodorants, and free radicals want to come and deplete the cells. They want to come and pinch the trace vitamins and minerals. So we need a protection. So we have an antioxidant that works like a security guard, go around, goes around the body mopping up the free radicals. And free radicals cause oxidative stress in the body. It's like internal rusting. If you cut open an apple and it, it, it goes brown, that's oxidization. That can happen in the body too. Um, so we have daily biobasics. This is our fiber, all our gut health, all our trace vitamins and minerals. We have the antioxidants. So these are like the little security guard. These can also help 
the blood to stay healthy. They can help stop red blood cells sticking together. Um, they're pure OPCs. Um, they are really important for helping your body to produce collagen and elastin, which is really important when you're doing the reset because you want your skin to shrink back. If we did, if we did the program without the nutrients, you'd end up with hanging skin. You'd end up probably quite poorly. You know, you need to make sure you've got really good nutrition. Um, we take omega three; it's really important for brain, eye, heart, lung function. They they can work like a little aspirin in in the blood in the blood sorry um really important for inflammation in the body and we take msm plus msm plus is organic sulfur it can help to cleanse the cells which is really good for cellulite i've got some uh, one of the photos in particular actually shows the, the difference with the cellulite on a girl's bottom um it cleanses the cells it can bind to heavy metals and toxins which again at the moment is really important and it um, can also work like a natural anti-inflammatory and a natural painkiller. So we must take those four products when we're doing the metabolic reset. Um, I think Holly can put a shopping basket together with the with the products in. Um, but there's two other products that we can take which do really help to get quicker results. Because when we cook protein, it's really important when you do a reset to have protein three times a day. But when we cook our protein, we kill off a large amount of the protein isolates. And it's the isolates that help the body to repair, help the body to burn fat. So the triple protein shake is pure protein isolates. It's phenomenal. And you can have it once a day or you can have it twice a day. I actually mix my daily by basics in with the protein shake. And that's my breakfast. I even take it on holiday with me. Always, always, always. I would never be without it. And I think, again, that's something that's helped to keep the weight off because it's helping my body to repair, helping my body to burn fat. Because the more repaired our body and our muscles are, the higher the metabolism. And then something else that people like to take. Um, I had a friend of mine, um, Lisa, who did the metabolic reset, and she had 10 days where she didn't lose weight. You mustn't ever worry about the scales. You just trust the process because as the body's repairing, you actually can gain weight. And, and I've got photos of a girl. Um, I haven't got them on this on this little collection, but I've got a girl who did the metabolic reset. She actually gained weight on the scales, but her body is so much slimmer because muscle weighs heavier than fat. Um, but something that can also help give the metabolism a little boost is Excel. And Excel is the has the Nobel Prize ingredient L arginine. L arginine can help to dilate the arteries, can help the body. Um, it helps to oxygenate the blood, so it can be a real help for metabolism. So there are different packages um, that include the Excel or or without. Um, so that's basically it in a nutshell. Oh, should we share some photos? Yeah, let me do the the share screen and bring up the the photos uh, okay no. this is my before and after picture mm -hmm. i didn't think i would ever share this with anybody in a million years <laughs> and i was on holiday for my before picture and i actually said to my ex-partner can you take my before picture for me he actually said are you sure you want me to when i looked at it i was horrified and when that is zoomed in, which you probably can't do, but you can actually see an overhang on my tummy. There was what we call an apron. Um, but my after picture is 28 days later. So that was 25 pounds lighter. Now, the thing that apart from the, that fat around the middle, I think the most noticeable thing is my jawline because we have visceral fat and fat in places that we really shouldn't have it. Um, so yeah, so I don't mind sharing the photo because I know I don't look like that anymore. <laughs> Let me go to the next photo. Oh. Okay, so this lady was really disappointed that she only lost five pounds, uh, sorry, five kilos, which is about 11 pounds uh, because all her friends were losing more. But it was only when she did the after photo that she could actually see that her body didn't have it to lose anymore. And the difference between her skin tone and how her bottoms lifted in 21 days is phenomenal. 
Yeah, you can see it in her waist dramatically. Yeah. I mean, people yeah. would look at her first photo and say, well, she really isn't fat. She doesn't need to lose anything. But now she's got that real hourglass yeah. figure. Yeah, it's like a sculpting tool. I mean, I've got some fabulous photos of men in the gym that just can't get rid of that layer of fat that, that covers the six pack. So this is a friend of mine from Germany, uh, Matthias, and he lost over 40 kilos. It took him eight months. But if he'd have done this with any other weight loss um, program, he would have ended up with skinny arms and skinny legs and he probably still would have had that middle, but you can see where it has just targeted that that fat around his middle, but he's maintained his muscle mass in his arms. Mm -hmm. Dramatic. Yeah. And then this, this lady, she actually did three cycles back to back and you can really, really see the difference. And, and somebody from that first picture in that shape I didn't think that their change that sorry their shape would have changed that dramatically yeah it is dramatic wow even the cellulite yes fun. yeah for sure and this is the really powerful one with cellulite now she did two cycles back to back so two days loading 21 days diet phase 21 days stabilization she went back round and did another cycle. So that's probably taken seven, seven weeks. Oh no, 14 weeks, seven weeks, six, six, seven weeks is one cycle. But the difference in the cellulite on the bottom where it's targeted that visceral fat, the fat cells have opened, so you cleanse the cells and the MSM plus has helped to cleanse the cells as well. Yeah, dramatic. Let's see if there's another picture. There we go. Yeah, and this is my friend Jackie's daughter-in-law, Emily, who always struggled to lose that back fat. She just couldn't get rid of it. And it took, she lost about 22 pounds. It took her about five weeks. It was a bit slower, but she did it. And after that, she went on holiday to Santorini and had the most fantastic photos with these beautiful backless dresses that she didn't think she'd ever be able to wear. Dramatic. I don't know if there's any more. Let's see. There we go. Yeah. And this is my lovely friend, Emma, who when Emma told me she was going to do the metabolic reset, I just said, Emma, you don't need to lose weight. When she showed me her after pictures, I was really shocked because actually that picture, when you zoom in again, it's, it was the difference on Emma's bottom and the cellulite and also her shell. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Look at the difference in her bottom and her shoulders. Yeah. Couldn't believe the difference on the shape of her shoulders. Amazing. Absolutely yeah. amazing. I don't know if there's any more. No, I don't think there's anything That's it. more. Okay. Yeah. All right. Stop. So we have um, a Facebook group, if anybody's on Facebook, with, um, it, they are private groups, so you can't search for them. So you need to be invited in by either myself or Holly. Um, and I keep them private because I protect the integrity of the groups because there's personal testimonials in there. But there's some fantastic results in there and some fantastic recipes. When we're doing the reset, I forgot to say, actually, we have a little guide that we've got on PDF. Holly's got the PDF and it talks us through the program. So it talks us through the different phases um, before before pictures are phenomenal to do. I know so many people that didn't take before pictures and they really regret it. Um, and then you've got somewhere to write your weight loss. You can weigh every day if you want to or you can weigh once a week. It's entirely up to you. And then it talks you through the different phases and talks you through the nutrition. So that's really helpful. We've got a little recipe guide as well. So if anybody is wanting to do the, the metabolic reset, we'll send you the PDF of that. So reach out to Sally or myself. And then also in the UK, if somebody wants to do this, why don't you talk about that? It's these, this is available everywhere except the UK, is it? We just, everything's available. We deliver to 65 countries, but at the moment I can't get any of the activate salt for, for two weeks. Holly can get it straight away. I've just got to wait two weeks. As soon as I've got it, I can actually send it out to people. Okay. Um, so yeah. Okay. That's, so that's if, you, the, if you're in the UK, and you want the activator salt, you might want to wait two weeks then for Sally and then she can ship it off to you. Yes. So you're, this uh, Life Plus is in 65 countries. Yes. 
Okay. We all we all order our products in exactly the same way, um, directly from the company. We all pay exactly the same. Okay. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, and that's where you have your little link that you can put in the in the bio at the bottom, isn't it? Okay. Well, I think this wraps up today's series on uh, metabolic reset and losing that visceral fat and getting healthy for 2024. And I will put the, the links in the bottom if um, anybody is interested. And if anybody wants to reach out to me or Sally, you guys know how to reach out to me and find me. And Sally is also on um, Telegram and Facebook. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Well, thank you, Sally, for being here. Okay. It's a pleasure. Bye-bye. <laughs> See ya.